This episode of I Am The Trend TV is brought to you by Threadbird Printing, high quality screen printing at affordable prices. Hello and welcome to I Am The Trend TV. I am Adam and today I'm really excited about this t-shirt review I have for you guys. Something very different, very cool. It comes to us from a company from the land down under, Australia, called Threadsmith. What Threadsmith has done is basically made it impossible for you to stain your t-shirt. So basically anything water related or water based, it'll repel and not soak into your t-shirt. You know, there's, there's days where you get up in the morning, you throw on your favorite t-shirt and you spill coffee on it and then you're just pissed because it's stained and it's just a pain in the ass. Well, not so with Threadsmith. Um, packaging, it's in a poly mailer. It's got the you know standard click and ship uh, low, uh, label on there. So, looks like it painted all in one piece. Um, the t-shirt itself is poly bagged, which is uh, a good idea when shipping that far. This is one of the world's first 100% cotton t-shirts made with a patented hydrophobic nanotechnology application. Man, that sounds intense. All right, so I got, I got my sauces and water and everything set up, and then I realized that I hadn't shown off the shirt yet. And I got nervous. Just in case I do ruin this shirt, I wanted to show it off first. So basically, all this shirt is is a white t-shirt. Um, it does have a small label on the sleeve here. Uh, but it's like a basic white t-shirt. It does have the Threadsmith logo on the back. Um, woven T-tag on the inside. Hang tag. Uh, also on there too, which is, which is really cool. Overall, it feels really nice. It's soft. It doesn't feel like it's coated in anything, so it's going to be interesting to see how this how this turns out. I imagine that it was going to feel different than most T-shirts since it has this nanotechnology on it. Uh, but it looks it looks like a solid white T-shirt. Um, I will say that these shirts are 50 bucks, so an expensive white T-shirt at that. And um, then again, if you can pour a cup of coffee on it and it walks away looking uh, brand new. It's pretty awesome. So um, let's go ahead and do that. Okay, cool. So I have a setup here with a Threadsmith shirt and I decided to go with water, soy sauce, and my favorite, Cholula, to see if any of these will stain or how they, and how the t-shirt holds up. So we'll start with the easiest stuff first. Water, I'm gonna pour this right on and see how that works. Wow, and it beads right up. Looks basically like if you're wearing a uh, like a nylon jacket, uh, but it doesn't. I'm trying to like push it into the shirt, and it doesn't. It also looks like it's like uh, water in zero gravity. It's really cool looking. So let's just go ahead and let that run off. So let's go ahead and up the ante and see if we can get this to stain. Little uh, low sodium soy sauce for you. So it beads right up. Um, it does look like it maybe have soaked in, maybe not, I don't know. So, we'll go ahead and just move it around a bit, see how that goes, and then I'm gonna lift it up. So I don't know if I did something wrong or if I wasn't supposed to put it on uh, the wet shirt, or the wet, uh, since I just poured water on it, but it looks like it's, it's stinging. Um, so that's not good. It's not what it's supposed to do. Um, so I'm confused. Well, we've already ruined the shirt, so let's go ahead and pour some Cholula on it. So I'll pick a spot that I haven't put anything on yet. Maybe that's maybe that's what I did wrong. Cholula hot sauce. So it looks like if you rub it in, it kind of you know it, it does stick in the shirt. We'll try a little more on the other side and see what happens if I was just to not rub it in and just lift it up. So we lift it up, runs right off. All right, so I'm back. Um, yeah, that didn't really turn out as I expected, but then I went over to um, the sink and I just rinsed off the part where the soy sauce was and that came like right out immediately. So I was panicked for a second that it didn't work as planned, but it, but it really did. Um, that said, the Cholula sauce while it's not in there as much as it would be on a uh, regular white shirt, um, it definitely still is in there a bit. Um, so it, it performed better than a typical white shirt, but it didn't disappear as much as the soy sauce. Um, they did say in the instructions to do something water-based where you know there's a lot of butter um, in 
butter and oil in a hot sauce. So I'm assuming that maybe that um, that's where I went wrong. But hey, man, I eat a lot of hot sauce. I, I had to test it. Um, I'm hoping that after one wash, it does come out. And um, I'll leave a comment below to let you know uh, how it held up. So it's threadsmith.com if you want to check these guys out. Really cool new technology and t-shirts. They have three shirts available now. It's white, black, and gray. Um, I'm really excited to wear this t-shirt because I think it's gonna be a high quality white fitted shirt. The shirts are 50 bucks, so a bit pricey, uh, but if you're into like cutting edge t-shirt technology, these are definitely um, some guys to check out and keep an eye out. Until next time, I'm Adam from IamTheTrend.com and I ask you to stay sure. This episode of I Am The Trend TV is brought to you by Threadbird Printing, high quality screen printing at affordable prices.